Yeah, let's bring in, by the way, Kevin O'Leary. The FBI has no information on this guy, but he has been taken to a mental health hospital. Let's bring in Kevin O'Leary, chairman of O'Leary Ventures and Shark Tank Investor. We're trying to get this time in. Kevin, I, I want your thoughts on the whole concept of pushing these EVs, knowing it's going to rise costs for a lot of items across the country. Unfortunately, everybody knows this mandate's timing is impossible. Um, we talk about this quite a bit in, in the sector of the economy where five to 500 employees, small businesses that use a lot of transportation services for consumer goods and services. There's no way this is going to work on that schedule. It probably no. takes seven to 10 years longer. So uh, the batteries don't exist for this. These trucks that are designed now can't even go past 200 miles. That's not the definition of a long haul transport. That's a short haul transport, won't work. The grid is woefully underserved. There's not enough charging stations. None of this is gonna work. And I don't wanna be a pessimist on it. It's just not realistic. And so what's gonna to have to happen is you see this mandate fall off its targets over the next 36 months, it's gonna to have to be adjusted. Otherwise you basically bankrupt where 62% of jobs are created in America, small business, you can't wipe out small businesses in America with a lofty mandate that doesn't have even the technology to make it happen. It's, we don't have the tech. So yeah. let's everybody wake up and smell the lithium batteries for a while. <laughs> they don't work yet. Yeah, uh, Kevin O'Leary, great to have you on. We apologize about the abridged interview, but thank you for that. And that is the story of Monday, April 1st, 2024. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.